Welcome and thank you for joining me. Today we're going to make this cute little wreath with English paper piecing. These are one inch hexagons and you will need six for the front and six for the back and enough fabric to wrap those in. Go ahead and baste them the way I've shown. You're going to put the right sides together and then you're going to connect them all the way around on the outside, leaving the inside open. Now, what I would like to do at this point is take it to the ironing board and press it, just because after I've removed those papers, some of the seams are a little loose, um, and I wanna reinforce those folds. So here, I've pressed it. You can see it's really crisp now. Let's go ahead and turn that inside out. Now, you're gonna to wanna to get those points out really well. Use something that's pointy but not sharp if you need a little help getting the points to come out all of the way. We have a crochet hook and I'm going to use that just to help me get the points out a little sharper than if I was just doing it by hand. And just keep working on that. Now what you're going to want to do is you're just going to want to close up one seam at a time and go ahead and stuff it as you go along. I do have the polyfill stuffing and you don't need enough or a bunch, just enough to make it look a little bit rounded. So I'm just gonna close this up and I'm just doing a whip stitch on the outside. Just a little bit and put that in there and then go to the next section and so forth and just keep doing this until you get to the last section. The last section you're gonna go ahead and stuff before you close it. That's the only difference because the other ones you stuffed after you closed it. Now I have added a bow. I did a few stitches into the bow. I added a hanger and then I did wrap the same ribbon around it and I think it looks so cute. What do you think? If you liked this video, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and happy sewing.